What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Juni Barreto, a.k.a. The Modern New Yorker. And I'm back for another vlog, man. First of all, I just want to say happy holiday weekend to everyone. Everyone that celebrates Easter. This is Easter weekend. Everybody that celebrates Good Friday. And we back outside, man. So today, on today's vlog, we are going to the New York International Auto Show 2024. Um, this is usually like a holiday tradition. Me and my son, we do almost every year. Sometimes we may skip a year. Um, but yeah, we back. And I got my guy with me. He's here. Say what's up. Hey. <laughs> so yeah, so let me ask you a question. What car manufacturers you looking forward to seeing today, possibly? Okay. Um, uh, Ferrari. Okay. And Dodge. Ferrari and Dodge. Okay. Well, I'm looking for those as well. Um, I'm looking forward to see what they got new from Honda, Acura, um, Mercedes, Lexus, and so forth. Um, and all the above, just to see some new, some new heat that they got. I love the concept cars. I love the costume cars that they usually have based off of uh, movies and film that they usually have. So, yeah, follow us. I'm going to take you inside. Yeah. So this is the 2024 Bronco Sport. This paint job is crazy, but... At least the rims match. <laughs> I'm going on the inside to look at the interior. What you think of it? What you think of it? I am about to step inside and see. Oh wow! Even the the seats. <laughs> oh, these seats is crazy. You sit inside. Eh, this interior is alright. Huh? I don't like how the car's on. Oh. I'm scared that the next door is the gas panel. Nah, don't worry about it. It's not going nowhere. Panoramic sunroof. Listen, don't, don't try nothing crazy. <laughs> yeah, guys, so this is a 2024 Ford Bronco. I'm okay. Sorry. Yeah, come on, man. You're trying to get. <laughs> trying to get my video flag, bro. Nah, it's all good, but yeah. Nice little space in the back. All right, let's see what else we got. All right, now we're about to sit in like the 2024 Bronco. Oh, you like it. Never mind. Yeah, this is nice. Where does the key go? Panoramic sunroof. This is nice. Hmm? Where does the key even go? It's push start, Johnny. It's 2024. No, it's not. We do. All right now, so now we're in the 2024 Kia Telluride. We're coming around right now. See what the interior looks like on this. Oh, yeah, this is more my speed. Why don't you fit this car? Ooh, I like the panoramic uh screen that we got here, the big screen right here. This is nice. We 
Nice room in the cubby. Cool sunroof. Is it panoramic? Plenty of room in the back. It's two sunroofs actually. Nice. So we just got back uptown from the New York International Car Show at the Jacob Javits Center downtown in Midtown Manhattan. This is the first of two weekends that the car show will be down at the Javits Center. Um, it's in town from this weekend, which is Easter weekend, March 29th, and it ends next month in April. April 7th is the last day of the New York International Car Show. So if you're in New York in the five boroughs and you want to go catch the car show, I'll definitely leave the link to the website to the Jacob Javits Center in the description section below so you can check that out. Also, the admission prices uh, for adults, which starts at 13 years old all the way up to adult ages, is $22. And for children ages 2 to 12, it's $8. And, you know, kids below that is free. So my experience for 2024 at the International Car Show, it was pretty decent. Um, a lot of the top brands was there, um, Honda, Hyundai. Uh, Jeep, Chrysler, and so forth. Um, Mercedes Benz was there. Um, a couple, uh, a couple of brands, a couple of brands wasn't there that I was kind of looking forward to seeing. Possibly Tesla. Tesla hasn't been back yet, um, and this is the second year in a row that Tesla wasn't there. Um, and I'm kind of disappointed because I wanted to see if, you know, they were going to have any new uh, 2024 vehicles there. Or maybe even see the Cybertruck there. So, that was a bummer. But other than that, um, I got a lot of pictures and B-roll and stuff of that nature. You know, you'll see that as well. So, I'll definitely recommend uh, going to the auto show. If, it's, if you've never been there and you want to experience it. Um, I think it's worth the money, $22 for Adults and eight dollars for kids is reasonable. There's a lot of a lot of things to do So they have vehicles you could test drive through different obstacle courses. Also, they have different like exhibits with Information on the latest technology and innovation for the you know Newest uh, vehicles that's coming up for 2024 2025 so it's a load of stuff to do a lot of information a lot of hands-on stuff that you could do for yourself and the kids. So again, I definitely recommend you going if you're a car lover. I'm definitely recommending this spot for the weekend. It's only in town for this weekend and next weekend. So April 7th is the last day. So make sure if you're in the five boroughs, go check this out. Again, I'm going to leave the link to the website in the description section below. So I'm going to end this video by saying Happy Easter to everybody out there. Hope you celebrate it safely with your families. And if you're new to this channel, I cover all things New York City for the best spots to eat and the best entertainment in the five boroughs. So if you're new to this channel, like, comment, subscribe. Turn on your post notifications. It's your boy, Junior Barreto, a.k.a. The Modern New Yorker. In a mouth. Peace. Old Porsches, 1968. Porsche 912. Nice.